All right, guys, today we are taking a look at the Smith & Wesson OTF Assist Finger Actuator. This is an interesting knife. So to open it, you push down on this, and boom, it shoots out just like that. Um, so we've got the spear point blade with the serrations. It also comes without serrations, and it comes in Tonto with or without serrations as well. Interesting uh, locking mechanism. So to unlock it and retract the blade, you got to push this guy down. It pops down a little bit. And then you pull the lever the rest of the way. And there you have it. So, uh, the overall length on this guy is eight and three quarters of an inch. Blade length is three and a half inches of AUS eight. And uh, the handle length is four and three quarters of an inch. Let me retract the blade again. Four and three quarters of an inch. It is aluminum and uh, they are gray. Very solid build on this guy. It, uh, it's quite heavy. It is 6.09 ounces, and you've got a pocket clip for tip down right hand carry. And the uh, thing I like about this knife, it's kind of a weird thing to say, but uh, this is probably the most budget friendly knife that uh, will still have you feeling like a Jedi every time you open it. Because uh, great action, and uh, it's, a, it's an OTF. You know, always fun. Always fun to have one of those things. Got a nice glass breaker on the bottom as well as a safety right there. And uh, yeah, let's do a size comparison next to our tactical clothespin. Give you an idea of how much you're going to be, how much real estate in your pocket this guy's going to take up. There you go. And uh, guys, go ahead and check this knife out at bladehq.com. This is the Smith & Wesson OTF Assist Finger Actuator.